TV on the Fritz. I'm not like a pervert or anything. I just, I just thought it'd be cool to capture this moment. You know what camera. perverts say? I'm not like a pervert or anything. That's true. If I was a pedophile, I'd be like, I'm not a pedophile. I can't really say anything. I asked you to have, be on like a blind date. Why well, we said yes to the blind date? Right. So I guess we're both kind of perverts, right? Well, unless this is some sort of a, a fetish about being blind, I thought it was just so we could find true love. Well, <laughs> your first date should be like your worst foot forward, right? When you think about it. If you put your worst foot forward and somebody accepts it, then you know that you're kind of on the right track. Are my boots That's a, popping? They're great. Thanks. Your dress is awesome. It's like a fish scale. Thanks. And your feet, I mean your legs, you have like a... I have legs. <laughs> so, the point of meeting me blinded I was under the impression it wasn't just like a, a, a fetish it, it was because I wanted to be able to get to know you without any preconceived notion of who you are I didn't want to be obstructed by your how gorgeous you may or may not be all I've got is your voice to go off of I see. which is very nice sounding thank by you. the way yours is too thank you hmm. did you have something you were afraid of now and sometimes you can find a way to get rid of that thing that nastiness do you, know how, do you know how I overcame mine? There was, I was given a small note that I opened and it said, do something that scares you. Mm -hmm. And I was like, well, there's not a whole lot that scares me. I decided that really the only thing that would scare me is feeling very vulnerable. And the only way I could really make myself vulnerable was to, that I could conceive of, is take off all of my clothes, have somebody tie me bondage style to a lamp post, and put, with marker wrote on my chest, talk to me. And I was and I was bound to that lamppost for an hour. Who freed you? A couple of people offered to free me. One person didn't say anything and just started like uh, whipping me. Uh, Wait, they, they, a had, couple they, people, they had they had a whip on them? Yeah, uh, a couple of people gave me water. I think people are good. Some ultimately. people just yeah, ultimately good. Yeah. I just, to be fair, the person who whipped me said, "Is it okay if I whip you?" And you said? And I said yes. Okay. The the interfacing with the, the human interface. You start with. I'm not, hungry. It's not innovation for the sake of innovation. You gotta, uh, languaging, you come to me. For languaging, convertible couch, come to me. No, I three. start with the purpose. And then I go Steve back. It's three, three E's. Steve It's. Steve It's with three E's, digital three here. Steve It's. It's ITZ. Three I's, did I say that? No, it's three, three E's. E's. Three, three E's. E's. Oh. Yep, Steve It's. Okay. What's the other one? What was the first one I showed you? Okay. Steve It's. Rolling action. This is when your character is swimming with sharks. Quiet on set. No one, hey, who said that? Quiet on, quiet who on said, set. Who said that? Quiet on set. Can I, can I get the main actor over here, please? Hey. Oh, yeah, yeah, sorry. Did you say quiet on set before? Uh, I was just listening to the sound mix, um, you know. Aren't you the lead actor in this film? That's right. You're also I'm, the sound, you're the sound guy now? I'm just quality oriented. I need you to go back in there. Go back in there. I need you. I got it. Action. TV on the